Hey my YouTube family, how are you guys doing? Happy Saturday and this title of this video is going to be called um, Story Time, Why Did I Leave the Jehovah Witness Cult? So, I'm going to, um, for those of you new, my name is Rosa and for those that have been around, welcome back everyone, hello everyone. Um, so, I don't know if you guys remember me talking about um, me leaving the um, the organization of Jehovah Witness, um, the cult, as everybody calls it. Um, I wasn't baptized into it, guys. I was just, um, you know, studying um, with the Jehovah Witness. Um, yes, I left. In 2019, so 2019, 2020, 2021, I've been out, guys, for three years now, and I feel amazing, guys. Um, yeah, I feel amazing, guys. I feel completely free. Um, you know, I don't miss it at all, my friends. I don't miss it. Like, I'm free, guys. And, um, the reason why I I left, um, was because, like, I felt like they were, like, attacking me. Like, I don't know, like, you know, like, they didn't agree with the type of dressing that I would wear and now that I go to church, guys, I go to um, a Pentecostal church, I try to, you know, dress decent. And I think today was decent was that my clothes couldn't be too tight. It couldn't be see-through. And that was not the case, guys. I, I, I would pick dresses that I thought that were, you know, appropriate, you know, for going to the Kingdom Hall, guys. Um, and so... I was like, okay, um, I never wear anything, you know, too tight. I make sure that I wear, you know, long skirts or long dresses that they show everything, you know, guys. So, it was hard for me, guys, to find clothes, you know, dresses that, you know, didn't, um, didn't have, like, openings. Like, they weren't, like, V-neck types, um... So I had a, you know, I, it would be very hard for me, guys, to find, you know, clothes that, you know, were appropriate, you know, to wear to the Kingdom Hall. Um, and so I felt like, you know, there was a lot of, you know, like a lot of, you know, secret talk behind your back. And I really didn't like that. Like, I'd rather for someone that is talking behind my back tell me in my face. And I felt like they were talking about everybody, you know, anybody came in, the, you know, you would get looked at like, oh, who she is. And I really did not feel comfortable with, you know, with that, guys. So, um, they don't celebrate holidays, guys. And I'm, you know, big holiday person. I love, you know, celebrating Christmas, um, my birthday, you know, my niece and nephew birthdays, you know, Thanksgiving, 4th of July. Um, Memorial Day, guys, um, Easter, you know, um, all that, you know, and they don't, they don't celebrate it, they, you know, they, 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 they think, you know, it is, it's pagan, but also, guys, what, what I don't get is that they celebrate graduation, sorry, guys, they celebrate graduations, and, um, they celebrate graduations and anniversary parties, no, like, no baptism parties, none of them. Um, they only celebrate graduation parties, anniversary parties, or, you know, weddings. That's it. And I'm, like, here, like, dumbfounded. Because I'm, like, you guys, that's, like, at graduation parties. It's kind of like the same thing, like, birthday parties. Um, so, they'd have this, you know, big dances for, you know, anniversary parties. And they'd bring, a, you know, a DJ, whatever, and they would have food, whatever. 
Um, I just, I think it's all fake, guys. I think it's all fake. And I just could not be a part of it. Like, I couldn't be a part of a cult, you know. And when 2019 came, guys, in July 2019, um, I got baptized in my church that I am now. And I'm happy with my church, guys. Um, I'm happy that my church, we're, you know, we're close knit people. We watch out for each other, like, you know, we're there for each other, and, you know, it's family. And, and the Jehovah Witnesses, is, is, I don't feel like it was family. I just felt like everybody was, like, two-faced. And, you know, everybody talked about everybody. Like, I don't know, guys. I'm not exposing anything, guys. But I, I, I'm thinking now that everybody was just two-faced. Nobody really wanted to be my friend, you know. They just wanted, you know me to share my personal information and then they go out and spray lies about me and so you know i learned my you know my lesson i to get involved with anybody you know any cult like that because it's not good for me so now it's like i'm happy at my church like i said guys i go to a pentecostal church and i'm happy guys and if you are in a cult guys and you want to get out get out now before it's too late guys um and so i have um friends here that have left the organization of jehovah witness and i'm so proud of you and you know it was kind of like an adjustment at first guys but i'm so happy that i left because i'm so happy now guys like i can express myself um when i was in there i couldn't really make youtube videos because they say oh we saw it rosa but now it's like I'm happy guys. Um I can you know they 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 send me letters guys, but you know what I do guys? I'm going to be honest, I rip them up. I don't read them because I I don't want to be part of that anymore. Like that's how they get to you guys is that they know when you're weak and they could you know they say, "Oh, we feel when you're weak, so we have to, you know, write you a letter." I'm not weak guys. Like I know that that's how they're going to get me to